You can do the halo with a dumbbell or kettlebell. I'll show you both, but if you have an option, I prefer the kettlebell in this bottoms up position. Either way, stand up tall with your knees soft, core engaged, glutes squeezed, and rib cage down. Press your shoulders down away from your ears. To begin, hold the weight forward of your chest and now shift it over to the side so that it is forward of your shoulder and your forearm is vertical to the point that you could let go and hold the kettlebell in place. Now shift it back next to your ear, clearing your shoulder and back behind your neck. In this position, we want a tricep stretch. So the kettlebell is coming down to my neck, not way up here. And now we're going to complete the circle that we're drawing around our head, shifting over to the other side and back to the starting position. Now move in the opposite direction, shift it over, drawing that circle around your head. As you get more and more familiar with the form, you can start to speed this up. No matter what, make sure once again that you're not wobbling through this, moving, arching your back or shifting side to side. If you're using a dumbbell, you can hold it here or here. I do prefer this grip, but only if you can keep a really strong grip on the dumbbell at all times and do not drop it, okay? All the same rules will apply. Shift over to the side, close to the ear, back behind the neck, other ear and around keeping that dumbbell in close to your head the entire time. 